Hey there, YouTube. It's me again, Piano Piper. And this afternoon, I have a quick little yabo to share with you guys. So, I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with uh, different tobacco, uh, pipe tobaccos, and pipe forums uh, on Facebook. Uh, there's all kinds of groups out there. Tobacco Reviews, uh, Old Briar, Gentleman's Club. There's a bunch of them out there anyway. Well, I'm a part of a lot of those. And uh, I stumbled across a post from a guy. And this gentleman uh, has time on his hands, like a lot of us do, because so many of us aren't working with the coronavirus going on. His father, whom has passed away many years ago, had an old tobacco shop. So this guy with time on his hands has been cleaning out that shop. And he stumbled across a box, opened the box up, and there was 12 jars of Tweaksbury and Company's Hobbit's Weed. From 1998. I mean, wow. <laughs> if you're into aromatics, uh, what a fine. So he spent a few days testing it uh, to check humidity levels and check for crystallization, checking for mold, etc., etc. Well, lo and behold, the tobacco turned out to be almost perfect for smoking. He tried a few bowls himself, smokes great, tastes great, so he offered it up for sale. That's what we've got here. Let me get this opened up. He's even put it in these little sealed pouches for me. Uh, so I have... Four Noggins Hobbit's Weed Match. They have the recipe to Tweaksbury's uh, blend. Uh, I've never had a chance to actually smoke the real version of Hobbit's Weed. So it's going to be uh, quite exciting. I'll have to do a video uh, comparing the two blends side by side sometime. But I'm going to go ahead and open one of these up. I want to smell this. Wow. <laughs> Incredible. Oh, man. <laughs> I could put some of this in my hand and put it in my mouth and eat it. it smells so good. Yeah, he's right. I mean, the moisture is perfect. Look at that tobacco. It sticks a little bit together. But it's still very, very smokable, just like that. Oh, man. I am so excited. My mouth is watering. <laughs> right off the bat, you get that cherry smell and the vanilla. I love uh, cherry vanilla aromatics, and I don't think you can get any better than the Hobbit Sweet. I love... Uh, Four Noggins version of it. And I, like I said, I've never had a chance to try the Tweaksbury uh, recipe. So this is going to be a really exciting smoke when it comes. Uh, I've had a little bit of a sore throat the last day or two. <clears throat> so I'm not smoking right now. That's why I haven't been putting out many videos. Um, hopefully I'll be able to put out a few videos soon. But anyway, guys, I just wanted to share that with you. 
this was an exciting find. If you're not a part of any of those groups on Facebook, by all means, get on there and get on those groups because you can get stuff like this. Uh, it's out there. So, till next time, guys, i got to go paint the front deck. Well, I've got the sun out there, and it's almost 60 degrees up here in Maine today. So, I'm going to get out there and enjoy the sun, get some of the honeydew list taken care of. <laughs> so, until next time, guys, be well, be safe, take care. <laughs>